We are almost a month away from the college football season. Getting back underway, bro. I cannot freaking wait. The countdown starts towards that now. College Football 25 coming out has definitely helped um, with making the time pass. But, uh, you know, I'm kind of craving some real-life college football at the moment. <clears throat> so, we have the SEC on CBS, the top 25 moments. I wanted to get a video showing just, you know, the SEC highlights, um, you know, just over the years. And I ended up coming across this, so we'll see what this is all about. Um, it says, disclaimer, I try to be objective, but a lot of this is based on my personal favorites. I'm only a teenager, so the vast majority of these moments will be from the 2010s. I'm also an Alabama Bama fan. So my bias towards Bama might also affect the list. Considering clicking off the video. Nah, <laughs> we're gonna give it a chance. I just better not see no Alabama on LSU shit, bro. Got 18 minutes. Jesus Christ, my volume was. Okay, we got Burroughs Heisman moment. Ooh, get up out of here. Get up out of here. So freaking beautiful, man. Let that thing go. Jay Jettas. Burroughs said, screw it. Jettas is down there somewhere. Man, I miss Joey B so much. You see his freaking blonde hair he has now? He's like a buzz cut with blonde hair, bro. It's very different. It looks like his high school days, kind of. He used to have that color hair in high school. I don't want to watch this shit, bro. I try my best to forget this game, okay? I try my freaking best. And you... Oh, my God. You know, I feel fine because we ended up beating this team next year in 2019. So it is what it is. It is what it is. We ended up beating Tua next year, so it is, it's all good. Uh-uh. What, what, what are we doing? What is this? Why are we showing two highlights from this game? I should have clicked off the video. Oh my... Brother. There's more games than just Bama LSU. I'm just saying. There's more games, bro. Oh my god. Oh, is this gonna be the freaking play where Jalen Hurts scored and they held like three different times? I remember this shit, bro. I remember all of this shit. Yep, one, two, three. Yep, yeah, look, let's go back real quick. Alright, this is gonna be one right here. Look. One. Two, three. Ridiculous, bro. Every time I see that, it makes me mad. Thank you. Okay. Another, another Bama one. Okay. I don't, I don't like seeing Bama succeed, bro. I don't. Oh my god, brother. We... How many times have we beaten Florida? We've beaten them, what, five times in a row? And you wanted to go back and choose the one time we lost? It's gonna be a pick six, I know. And that's the last time they beat us, bro. That's the last time. That's the last time. Got me getting all defensive and shit, man. <laughs> Florida, Tennessee. This video has been filled with the two teams I do not like. Bama and Florida. That makes me sick. 
Wait, what year was this? Will Greer. Okay, he was kind of nice, not gonna lie. Butch Jones. Tennessee fans love themselves some Butch Jones, huh? Georgia Tech. Oh, God. 2022. Hendon Hooker to Tennessee. Stetson Bennett. Bryce Flex, or no, talking about call or something, I don't know. Man, at least one of the bums loses. Tebow. Wow. Interception thrown by Tebow. That's I didn't even check that that was That's Tebow. That some coaches in this league <clears throat> are not accustomed to. How about the night for Greg McElroy? How about the loss for Tim Tebow? Oh god, dude, that makes me sick. Auburn over Bama. This is what I like to see. Yep, get moving, Stidham. Get moving, Jarrett. Yes, sir, boy. This is a year that Auburn beat Georgia and Bama when they were number one. Was it Georgia and Bama who were both number one or something? Is this the DJ Chark comeback? Is that what this is? No, it's not. Sending him out there to win that shit. Blake Ferguson will snap it. If it's good, they go back to the bayou. Yes, sir. First place in the West. On the road. Two seconds left as time expires. Cold freaking blooded. Yes, sir, bro. That got me so hyped. Look at Joey. <laughs> Coach. <-o. laughs> yes, sir. Heartbreak. 2019, Auburn beats Bama. Yeah. If Bama would have won this game, they probably would have made the playoff, and they probably would have rematched with LSU for the championship game. Just like they did in 2011. And it would have made me mad. It would have made me very mad. How about them Bama kickers, man? Stepped on by Jonah Williams as he threw the ball. <coughs> and that doesn't look good at all. He spent a lot of time in the tent in the first half, and he's going back to the tent, I can guarantee you. And that means Jalen Hurts. And Jalen Hurts comes in and I saves the day. Won all but two of the games that he started and was replaced at halftime of the national championship game on January 8th. Comes in to take over. Just inside the 16, quarterback draw, Jalen Hurts. Scored against Clemson when he left the and over Bama, Johnny Football's Heisman moment. Yeah, he lost the ball. That's insane. Johnny Manziel was different, bro. Kevin Summon was a better coach at AM than Jimbo Fisher. That's 
smart, the defensive coordinator. I think he thought what I thought. They Stop had. a playmaker. That's crazy like to say. Manziel, you gotta get him. And this time, Alabama. Oh, look at almost a fumble of the ball. That's what kind of threw everybody off on the play. Fourth and goal. McCarron will throw it. It's intercepted. Does Shazer ever get the goal line? Yes, sir. Kenyon Drake, I remember him. AJ McCarron couldn't stand him. 2011 Game of the Century, then we had Game of the Century Part 2 in 2019. Crazy, bro. Man, why can't we get our defense back to this freaking standard, bro? We'd be. Oh. This is what I want. I want a freaking elite defense over an elite offense, man. I know offense is winning this in today's game. But, like, I just love some good defense, bro. Got Jordan Jefferson in at quarterback. Whew! Look at Michael Ford, baby. Let's. They caught him out of bounds, yeah. Put it in there, boy. Get up out of here. Less freaking miles. Oh, get to see Joey B pick apart Bama now. Third down and two. Field goal makes it an eight point game, but they don't want a field goal. Joey keeps it, man. <laughs> Bro, every play Joe Burrow put together with a Hyman moment. This run, though, my god. Get up out of here. Get up off of me, boy. <laughs> that play. Clyde Edwards Elair, dude. Yes, sir. Be heartbroken. Is this the T- Oh my god, it's the TJ Yeldon screen. Oh, this haunts me in my freaking dreams, bro. <sighs> freaking TJ- we, we had this game freaking won, bro. And all they do is go to TJ Yeldon. And this was not the first time they went to him. Makes me freaking sick, bro. Nine seconds left. In trouble in the backfield. Wants to throw down. He's gonna go deep. Who's that quarterback? Oh my god. Oh bro. Oh. Is that a oh Felipe Franks? Holy shit. I, for, I completely forgot about that, dude. Arkansas Ole Miss. Jesus, dude. 105 total points. Fourth and 25 in overtime on the road. Last chance for Brandon Allen of the Razorbacks. Fourth and 25. It's complete to Henry. Ole Miss. Knocks it away. Incomplete. Well, correction. It's a lateral. Is that Alex Collins? Didn't he pass away? I think he was on the Ravens and he passed away, didn't he? Like not too long ago, a couple years ago, maybe? Henry makes the catch. Oh my god, they're gonna go for two. Giving up a 4th and 25 like that, dude. Oh my god. Collins 
next to Allen. Morgan, fake it. Allen takes it, dives, and he is in the two-point conversion. My goodness. The rocky block, I remember this. It was Marcel Darius running with him, a defensive tackle. Volume's really low for this Four one. seconds to go. Lincoln for the lead. Oh my god, dude. Cody again. Oh my. Alabama wins. Horrible. Oh, there's a fight going on. Look at this. Right over here. He just got shoved. <laughs> Look at that, bro. Beat his ass, fellas. Beat his ass. Come on. The miracle at Jordan Hare. Nick Marshall. That's insane. Uh, like, I've been saying, there's some kind of magic within Jordan Hare. Like, especially at night ga night games. And, like, as an LSU fan, I've experienced it against us. Like, there's some kind of freaking magic in that stadium, bro. It's, it's insane. I hate playing on the road there. Grave Digger in the corner. <laughs> Fourth and freaking 31. That's all it is. Airspace to cover for Milro. Still looking. Firing. Near I mean, honestly, you should have just brought a blitz. I'm not a, I'm not a, like, I'm not a fan of letting a quarterback just sit back there, sending three, two or three, and just giving him all the time in the world. Because eventually, somebody's going to pop open at some point. I don't know if I would consider that necessarily open. It was just, it was a good throw. I mean, he was a little bit open, but. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a fan of that. I would I would be aggressive <laughs> and uh, make Milrow rush because he had like freaking he, he had all the time in the world, bro. On a fourth and a mile. We always keep thinking we've seen it all and we never have, have we? Bond. I watched this live Bond. too. And now Isaiah Bond went to Texas because of a Lamborghini. The disaster in the past here. Oh my god. Looking for Brooks in the corner. Got it! Touchdown, Alabama! Bryce Young. You got a guy it wasn't Bama down like 10 nothing or something in this game? I don't know. I don't exactly remember. TJ Finley. Former LSU quarterback. Bo Nix. Okay, we got the top three coming up. 2022 Tennessee Bama. Yeah. Give Alabama the lead from 50. Rikers kick on the way. Pushed it to the right. No good. Chase McGrath for the win for the Volunteers. Just watch the sea of orange behind him. Knuckleball. <laughs> Dude, that was a that was a crazy scene. Eason has it. Steps up, looks deep, goes down the left side. He's got a man open. Touchdown! Riley Ridley! That's crazy, bro. Jawan Jennings.
freaking chimera with the with the balls. The kick six. It never gets old seeing this. Like, it's one of those things where it's like, do you remember where you were when you saw this? sad not gonna lie um yeah it's it's gonna be weird not having scc on cbs anymore now i'm gonna miss the theme song when uh when it starts playing for big games like for lsu bama man lsu florida like it, i'm gonna miss it i'm gonna miss that theme song it's gonna be weird seeing that being played for big 10 teams um you know, there's just so many more big matchups in the SEC than there is the in the Big Ten. Um, you know, the Big Ten big matchups would be like Penn State, Ohio State, Penn State, Michigan, Ohio State, Michigan. Um, I mean, what else? Like, what else is so intriguing about that conference? Like, Iowa is not exciting to watch. Um, I mean, you got USC and UCLA, Washington. Um, now Oregon coming in there, so I guess you got Ohio State, Oregon, um, you know, Michigan, Oregon, Penn State, Oregon, all of them, but, um, you know, USC, UCLA, and Washington, they're not, Washington just made the title game last year, but they lost a lot, um, a lot, <clears throat> UCLA got a new coach, lost Chip Kelly to Ohio State, so they're not gonna be anything, really, USC, who knows if they're going to turn things around with Lincoln Riley. Um, but yeah, man, it's just like four teams in the Big Ten, really. Um, but in the SEC, bro, you got so many good freaking matchups, so many good rivalries. There's just nothing like it, man. When they say it just means more, it does. It freaking does, bro. Um, but yeah, uh, I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Uh, what do you think was the best moment uh, in this video? Or the best moment with the SEC on CBS? Like, what is one memory that you guys have uh, from watching your team on CBS? Um, hope you all enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like, hit that subscribe button. I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.